the Democratic Party and their allies in the Hollywood crowd are banking on director Steven Spielberg to pull them out of their disastrous slump. Spielberg is banking on none other than Hillary Clinton as he announces plans for his new movie. Breitbart reports, Hillary Clinton and Steven Spielberg are joining forces to bring Elaine Weiss the Woman's Hour, the great fight to win the vote to television. Amblin TV, the television production division of Spielberg's Amblin Partners, has named Clinton as an executive producer of the project, with talks still ongoing as to whether to turn the critically acclaimed book into a series or TV movie. Report St. Flix, Amazon, Apple, and HBO are among the online stream and premium cable networks that Amblin TV will pitch the project to which comes as no big surprise. Spielberg started his Trump-hating crusade last year with his movie, The Post. He was emphatic that the premier was a way to hurt the Trump administration. Speaking with The Guardian, Spielberg said, the level of urgency to make the movie was because of the current climate of this administration, bombarding the press and labeling the truth as fake if it suited them. I deeply resented the hashtag alternative facts, because I'm a believer in only one truth, which is the objective truth, added Spielberg. Now, he is teaming up with the one woman whom the country rejected, Hillary Clinton to make a woman's film to hurt the one man whom the country elected. We never said these Trump haters were political wizards. One thing Spielberg did get right was appealing to the women's vote. This new TV movie chronicles the activists who led the decades-long fight to grant women the right to vote and sheds light on how close the battle to ratify the 19th Amendment really was. But what really drew Spielberg to the book by Vice is her own Trump hatred and how she worked that into her storytelling. The Hollywood Reporter writes, Sources say as Vice was writing the book, she was struck by the parallels between the women's suffrage movement and the 2016 presidential election between Clinton and Donald Trump. They add, it then became a priority for the author and journalist whose work has appeared in multiple publications and on NPR to get her book in Clinton's hands. Wow, sounds awfully impressive. But there's just one big problem for Spielberg and Hillary and her name is Melania Trump, who really is going to be drawn to watch a Clinton-backed movie. Mostly Democrats and some independents, which are important for Trump, don't get us wrong. But Melania Trump is a star with the Democrats. Newsweek reports, Melania Trump is three times more popular than her husband Donald Trump among Democratic voters, according to a new poll. The survey, conducted by CNN, showed that 51% of Americans have a favorable opinion of the First Lady. 51% of independent participants told poll takers they have a favorable opinion of her, adds Newsweek. Now, this is a poll conducted by fake news CNN. Imagine what the real numbers are for Melania with Democrats and independents. That's one important thing that poor Hillary and her Hollywood Trump-hating friends Spielberg aren't taking into consideration. In a statement released Wednesday, Clinton said she is thrilled to be working with Amblin Television in the project. At the heart of democracy lies the ballot box, and Elaine Weiss' unforgettable book tells the story of the female leaders who in the face of towering economic, racial and political opposition fought for and won American women's right to vote, the failed presidential candidate said in a statement. The Hollywood crowd can make as many women's movies and anti-Trump hit pieces as they want. What they don't get is that Americans aren't fooled by their new so-called patriotism. Sure. Spielberg has made some great American movies, but the fact he thinks Hillary Clinton will be a spark plug to appeal to women voters is comical. No matter how many excuses the failed presidential candidate comes up with explaining why she lost, the truth is, she was in this crooked. Melania Trump is a breath of fresh air. She is by far the best secret weapon our president has, and we don't need a movie to tell us that. Thanks for watching. What did you think of this video? Let us know in the comments section below. You can also subscribe for more videos like these in your inbox. Now if you are seeking the latest trends in fashion, and electronics and gifts and more of the coolest things that you never knew existed at the best prices, please feel free to visit www.atthesmall.com once again that is www.atthesmall.com. Dot com. If you are seeking the best in facial and clear skin regiments and products for women and men including an opportunity to earn residual income, please visit our partner at www.jdro.my.rnf.com, 
All links are in the description box below. Share this video with your friends and family. Since you're watching, we have a small favor to ask. More people are viewing our videos more than ever but advertising revenues across the media are falling fast. And unlike many news organizations, we haven't put up a paywall. We want to keep our journalism as open as we can. So you can see why we need to ask for your help. Our videos and reports takes a lot of time money and hard work to produce. Our investigative reporting uncovers unethical behavior and social injustice that helps to hold governments, companies and individuals to account. Through this we can, together, create meaningful change in the world. We do it because we believe our perspective matters, because it might well be your perspective too. For as little as one dollar, you can support us, and it only takes a minute. Thank you. Like and share this video on Facebook and Twitter if you agree. Don't forget to support this channel by clicking on the donation link down below and subscribing so you never miss any of our trending reports. What do you think about this video? Scroll down to comment below. We have changed to a new YouTube channel, the link is in the description box below. Please subscribe to the new channel, as this one will no longer have new videos and reports posted to it anymore.